Hey yeah, everybody, so let's talk about do while loops. A do while loop is a variation of a while loop. So a while loop first checks a condition, then it executes a block of code if that condition is true. So we may not even execute that block of code at all if that condition is false from the get go. A do while loop always executes a block of code once, and then we check a condition at the end. If that condition is true, we will continue another loop. So here's what I'm thinking for a demonstration. We'll create a small program where we will have a user type in as many numbers as they want, as long as it's above zero, and then we will find a sum. So if we're writing a program like that, we can first declare two variables, int number. I'll go ahead and assign these some values right away. So we'll set number to zero and int sum equal to zero as well to keep track of the sum. We'll first begin by creating a while loop. So we will use a while loop and our condition is if number is greater than zero, then we will continue to ask the user to type in some numbers. If that number is zero or less, then we stop. So let's ask a user for a number. Enter a number above zero. And then using scanf, we will accept some user input and store this within number. And let's check to see if number is greater than zero. If it is, we will take sum, set this equal to sum plus number. But you can just shorten the statement to plus equals number. That's fine too. And then at the end, we will print whatever the sum is. Sum, we're displaying an integer and we are displaying sum. So with our number, I set this to zero. And since our while loop is checking the condition first, we're not actually going to execute this body of code. So our program skipped this while loop and went straight to the printf statement. So a while loop checks a condition first. A do while loop will check a condition last. So to change this to a do while loop, we will take our condition and move it to the end, just after the last curly brace and add a semicolon. And then before the first curly brace, we will add the word do. So we will do this once and then check the condition to see if we would like to continue. So now if I run this, we get that prompt, enter a number above zero, and I can type in as many numbers as I want. So one, two, three, four, five. So we check the condition at the end. So our condition is that if our number is greater than zero, we will continue this loop. So if I type in negative one, we will exit, and our sum is 15. So that's the major difference between a while loop and a do while loop. A while loop checks a condition first, then executes a block of code if that condition is true. A do while loop always executes a block of code once, then checks a condition. If that condition is true, then we continue again. So yeah, that's a do while loop. It's a variation of a while loop. And if you would like a copy of this code, I'll post this to the comment section down below. And well, that's the do while loop in C.